What's up guys, this is Cher talking, welcome back to my channel, in today's video I will show you how to defeat Carmine with just one character. Yes, we have some characters that can solo content, and one of them is the latest Bertrand. Well, he is just too strong for damage, but also very good defensively. Because of his uh, twin goldfish counter, that gives him an uh, attack boost and a defense boost, and those things stack, and you can get plenty of it. That means that Bertrand will hardly take any damage. Not just that, but he also has a chance to chase with Cure Fire and Cure Water when he's attacking directly, not countering. And this will heal him for more than 1000. So, when he's attacking, he's healing. When he's countering, he's protecting and getting stronger. So, Bertrand is a very strong character for Remembrance. Even though it's not hard to finish the Sword Remembrance. It's one of the easiest ones. But maybe you are a new player and don't have Polka. So, Bertrand can help you. He will work in all Remembrance battles, but I'm just showcasing him on the last one because I know some people are still doing it. Well, Bertrand needs the Fusion Edge weapon that you can craft right now in the game. If you cannot right now, it will be available again later. And if you cannot craft it right now, you can also try to craft a sword with a water element on it. Because Twin Goldfish is water-based and it's the thing that matters the most here in this fight. With all that said, the best defensive equipment is the Titan Suit, because it gives him lots of resistance, but you can use something else. The best helmet is this Yokubo Squid Hat, because it gives 44 points for Blunt. And then we have Proof of Fort Tower, if you don't have, it's not a problem, it's just the best accessory to bring, and also bring an out uh, ailment resistance stone instead of this one, I used this for some fight and forgot to remove. So, uh, this is the equipment that you have to bring, and then the formation is Rising Phoenix X, because this formation will give him endurance and wheel buffs, that means that he is going to take less physical and magical damage, but it also buffs intelligence, that means that he will do more damage, and reduces damage taken by uh, 30%, and that should be enough to allow him to survive uh, till he starts stacking Twin Gold Fish to get more, defense boost, and then start healing back the damage that he takes. So, uh, bring four units that are useless, even equip them so that they die faster, so that he is the only target in the fight. Don't try to bring people with their equipments and their skills, because this will just slow Bertrand down. 